Well, I think you guys already know what this is going to be. So, let's do a little unboxing. I want to say that uh, Customs right now are very picky about every little thing. They held this package up for two weeks because it was missing a value on the accessories section. Absolutely ridiculous. After all that headache and hassle, they sent me the wrong I ordered a synthetic rope and this is what I got. What am I supposed to do with this thing?
I want to say I don't think that this plate <laughs> is going anywhere. Um, I did a uh, triple base weld underneath from the bottom and then uh, put this uh, spare half inch plate that I had on here and tied it right back into that beam. Ridiculous uh, amount of strength on that. It looks pretty cool. I was thinking about welding a uh, two inch receiver hitch right here. It would be perfect. Just put one right here and then you could put, you know, front mount, I don't know, bike rack or motorcycle rack or whatever the case may be. I thought that would be a pretty cool idea. I might order one. Uh, it's pretty easy to put on at another point. Um, this is a very basic winch install that I'm not putting a whole lot of effort into. I'm just kind of dilly-dallying around to get it uh, set up and ready to go. I might put a nice little border around it here or I might extend the bumper out. I don't know yet. I can always do that at a later date. Um, what else was it going to... Oh, that plate, by the way, is uh, available on Amazon. I will leave a link down in the description. It's plenty of metal for what we're doing. I still have a bunch of it left over um, from the parts that I cut off. So um, I'll probably utilize those to uh, maybe beautify this a bit. It actually looks pretty good with the winch on it though. Here, let me show you. So just with the winch by itself, imagine it painted uh, desert tan. It would look pretty good just like that with the uh, fair lead and the uh, synthetic line that I had to order. So you may have noticed I took all the cable off of it. I'm just so tired of waiting on the the thing. You know, it's been almost a month I was waiting on this thing. I figure, what the heck, what's another hundred bucks to uh, just change it to synthetic? And then I'll have a spare cable for whatever. I just hate using cables on winches because uh, of the spring back on them. It's just so dangerous. I did bend these uh, airlines up a bit and I replaced them. So I put brand new ones on there. I tilted the cab and checked it. Uh, this bar sits about a millimeter right off the top of the, the winch there. So um, I think tomorrow will be a better day to uh, continue on this. I've been screwing around with this now for way too long. And um, I'll probably get the holes drilled in that plate and maybe come up with a just a little shield to put around the front of it so that I'll have, you know, I was thinking of taking these little triangles that come with the kit and maybe putting them right there and on the other side. I thought maybe that would look pretty neat. I also have um, these larger pieces left over which might look even better. I don't know if I could get both of them on there like that, but, or maybe I'll put them on the, the side here or something like that. I don't know. We'll come up with uh, some funky idea to uh, close that in just a little bit. Maybe make a little armor for the winch. So when we do hit tree branches, it just pushes them out of the way. Not that it wouldn't do it with just that plate there, but lots of options left. It's been a while since I've done uh, any work on Able aside from uh, maintenance. So I did not disconnect the batteries. I turned off all of the circuit breakers in the shelter. Um, that was a big hoo-ha last time I was welding on the truck. I didn't I didn't disconnect any of the batteries, so we'll see what blows up this time uh, Last time it was a little pressure transducer on the uh, Air tanks back here was uh, This little guy and it might have been just a coincidence uh, That it stopped working after I was done welding the exoskeleton Um, Willow got home and I didn't realize she was here. It's Veterans Day today, so I took the day off and tomorrow off too, so uh, I could work on this project and get it done. Anyhow, enough of me uh, rambling on and on and on, like I always do. If you uh, guys like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you're uh, not subscribed yet, we'd love to have you as a subscriber. 
this will probably take me, I don't know, another couple days to get done. Got to get it mounted. Um, weld a few more things like I was talking about, and then we got to do all this fun stuff. You know, wiring, wireless remote. Um, and then I'm just going to be waiting on the synthetic line to come in whenever that gets here. I ordered a, it's supposed to be three quarter or 14 millimeter line that's supposed to have a, you know, 35,000 pound rating. So that'll take a week or two to get here, but probably won't be using the winch before then. So, but other than that, guys, uh, I hope you're staying safe, taking care of each other. And as always, I'll catch you next time. See you later. Bye-bye.